What is the crack, lads? And welcome back to Dream Team Chronicles. It's been a while. It's been a while. The hair is all over the place. I've had a I've had a rough morning. Um, but yeah, we've been we've been good. We're just on uh, gonna be playing some matches on our lunch break. We're gonna be going in. It's been ages, lads, since I've played this, so I'm probably gonna be very rusty. Um, I've been playing a lot of PES 2013, so apologies for you guys that were asking me. I'm back. I'm going to have about four videos out this week because I'm going to be smashing Dream Team, depending on how it plays. I mean, I've been hearing mixed things about it again. Um, you know, some people enjoying it, some people not enjoying it. Before we get into that, lads, right, two things. Uh, for everyone asking about a PES Universe option file for PES 2022 season, uh, season update, so like Haaland at City and, and, and all that good stuff, um, the boys are working on one as far as I know. We will have more details on that soon, but they will be doing an option file for this season in PES 2021. And then secondly, we have this, right? So heading over to the actual rankings of the eFootball Championship Open, um... I mean, it's just it's just going into it's just going into crazy territory now. I mean, there's people here, like on this list, and as as I said, I'm not going to cast aspersions. I'm not going to cast anything against people. I'm not going to accuse people of anything. I mean, it's there in black and white or blue and white, whatever way you want to look at it. Um, you know, this is the actual rankings from one to all the way down to fifty, and then you can go on and on and on. But yeah, I mean, again, Les, what are you thinking of eFootball at the moment? I mean, I haven't played enough of it since V1.1.2. Um, and I've kind of gone on record and said that I loved the game best when it was at V1.0. I think that's when everyone was kind of, um, you know, really, really happy with it. So for me, that's kind of when it was at the peak of its powers. And I'm interested to see how it's going to hold up now today when I play. Um, because as I said, I'm hearing a lot of mixed stuff about it. But we're going to crack on with the game. We do have a couple of chance agents and we are going to open a couple as well. I mean, I would love Carlos, man. I would love Carlos. He would really make a difference on that left back spot for me because I know Davies is there um, and I know I wouldn't be able to play Carlos with the Barcelona squad, but we could do a Madrid past and present squad as well, which would be insane. We could get Ronaldo and we could have all those guys playing. Um, but we do have a couple of free ones. We have three free ones. So this could be good. I've seen a couple of people get Carlos in their first spin, um, but no, my luck, I won't. Carlos is Carlos is probably the player I would say I would like most. So I am probably going to spin for this. So it's English League. It's only three star. We'll skip on from that. Ariola, a nice keeper. I think I already have him. I think he's a duplicate. If I'm not mistaken, maybe I released him. I'm not 100% sure, but we will open up again. But yeah, I might open a couple of cheeky spins for Carlos because he probably is... Yeah, the, my favourite, like, left back or one of my favourite players. Ooh, hold on. Four star, no good. Oh, who's that? Hazard. Not bad, lads, not bad. Hazard's about 100,000k, 100,000 GP. Not bad. He's got unwavering form as well, I think, for some reason. We'll take that, four star. And then last but not least, we've got one more. We've got two days left in that agent, so we might open up a couple of cheeky ones after we play a game or two and see how we do in the eFootball Open. Um, but yeah, let's see. Let's see if we can get him here. Oh, five star. Come on, Carlos, please. No way. Nah, it's not Carlos. It's Casemiro, though. What a what a beast. Casemiro, lads, is one of the best DMFs in the game. Uh, he's an absolute tank. And I think that I do have Vieira, obviously, there. And I have Busquets. But Casemiro is going to be a really good player as well to level up. We're going to take a look at his stats and see what we could actually do with him. Because, he, man, he has so many good stats. Unwavering form. His acceleration isn't the best, but he does have anchorman on. He does have tackling, aggression, defensive engagement, um, physical contact, and stamina is really, really high as well. And I think he has 23 levels, so he'll be able to go up and boost him up quite high. But yeah, we will see, lads. Let's see what he is without wide as well. He's 61, so we'll need to boost that up. But yeah, we're going to head on, lads, and we're going to open up a couple of more of these after another match. All right, lads, so we're into a match. I actually forgot to, to change my squad, so it's no biggie. It's no big deal. Uh, we still have a beastly squad with this Barcelona squad, uh, but I did forget to change it, so we are missing a couple of players uh, that we would usually have in. Um, so, yeah, my bad. Well, this guy has gone full, kind of full meta. He's got his three CBs with Alaba there, Casemiro, Rodri, Maradona, and then his front, front tree as well uh, with Cafu at the back. So it is going to be a difficult game. I think anyone that plays like this is uh, is going to be you know, going to know what they're doing. Playing against the... Oh, don't go sweat now. All right, that's fine. He's got Neymar. He's got Alaba. Get up. Lovely. 
been ages since I played, lads. Ages. Oh, here's Casemiro now. Just, just signed him, but we'll get full viewing of him. Oh, no, not through the legs. Hold on, Araujo. Lovely. That's good play, lads. Out of the way there, Pedri. Good lad. A wide. Big ball. No pace in the pass, though. Oh, we could panic. Panic in Skywalker. Nah, this guy's composed enough. Rock planet. Where is he? Oh, Pedri, he loves running onto these ones. Keep going. Ronaldinho. Oh, what a goal. What a goal. Back of the net, baby. Ronaldinho. Man, what is with the passing? Oh, I'm rushing out. I'm rushing out. Ah, oh, I tried to press down there and he just didn't go. That's frustrating though, man. I mean, De Jong just passed it straight to the player out in the wing. Yeah, De Jong, you should be hanging your head in shame there. It's completely your fault. I like that. That was actually quite cool. Because that was totally De Jong's fault there, to be fair. I'm not going to let you watch it because I'm being bitter. Ah, oh, man, the passing is... Oh, it's, it's a 9 me now. Go on, Romario. <laughs> Lads, this is beautiful football. Nay, nay. Cut inside. Short one. Oh! take the sting out of it a little oh man the passing like it's just like what is that like man Cafu is a monster isn't he fairness back come out keeper oh my days oh my days this game lies is so annoying it's so annoying it's actually so annoying ah <sighs> Why, why, why is that a goal, like? How is that a goal? Oh, it was a good opportunity. Just need to bring Messi in now, I think. He's going to go with Neymar again, watch. Eventually. Yeah. Man, it just doesn't give me control of the keeper then. He can hear me clacking it. Or Mario. Romario! Oh! Sit down! It ain't over yet. We don't gift wins around here. Romario, lads, he's unreal. Go away, Casemiro, you complained about nothing. Push forward, me hold. That was a crazy game, lads. We need to switch our squads over. I think if we had our normal squad, we would have beat that guy. All right, lads, we're back. Match two, we've got a B squad now back. We've got the B squad ready to go. We've got Corona, we've got Neymar, we've got Ronaldinho, Romario. Messi didn't really do it for me in that last game. Pedri was quite decent, but we are going to start with this squad, see how it goes. I actually don't like playing against guys with four, four uh, forwards, lads. Because they're, they're, they could do anything. They're used, to losing the, they're used to losing games because they don't really care. Romario! Oh my god, the responsiveness, man. What is he doing like? He just turns his head. No penalty. It's no problem. Goretzka. Boom! Dancing feet. Dancing queen. Young and sweet. Only Goretzka. It's a lucky goal, lads, but I should have scored there. I don't know what is going on with the penalty there. Connor Mario. Lovely. Ronaldinho! It's two. And it's that man again, Corona, on the wing, lads. Take it, lads. It's been a comfortable enough first half for us. I mean, he's very heavy on the sprint button. 
and he's very heavy on the shoulder charge. So I'm just trying to not concede a goal here now and uh, hopefully have this match over by half time. I don't like. I'm not going to play 15 games of that. I'd rather play the division system and hopefully go from there. But yeah, we do get the 1,000 points. We do get the reward. We do clear the event. And I know that guy's team wasn't good, but the difference there between having Vieira and like a few of the other players, like they just, they're just beasts like. Okay, lads, this guy has got a 4 2 1 3. Alaba up in Meccano, Matip, Eder Mil Militao, uh, Pedri Bellingham. This is a good squad. I haven't come up against Richarlison or Mane much, Diaz much. Um, he got those three players, obviously, from the spin. But yeah, very decent team, to be fair. Very decent squad. Let me see who's up for it. The boys, PK's up, but he won't start. Yeah, I mean, this team is fine, I think. Concentration mode now. Seppo style. This guy is called You Will Lose 03 Road to Pez Pro. Okay, so he obviously thinks he's a beast. He probably is a beast. He's off. He's off. Oh, what a goal. He absolutely rinsed me there. I thought he was offside, to be honest. And he scores in his first attack, lads. Not a good sign for me. Defensively, I was all over the place. Pedri, I don't know what he was doing there. Yeah, that's a poor start for me. Mario, spin him. And the finish. Boom! What a goal, lads. Or Mario, is just unreal. Booker T, spin a Rooney. It's a heavy game, lads. Very heavy. Oh, come on, man. They're passing. Why is he... Oh, he's just passing it to the man, like. Jesus Christ. And caught open then at the back. What a save, Manuel. It's just ridiculous, man. The passing from Messi. 100 overall. And he just literally is like, I'm going to try and pass to the opponent. Get a grip, like. Go on, Pedri, make your favourite run. Messi! Boom! <sighs> Where's Messi gone? He's gone into the crowd. Go on, Messi, get into that crowd, son. Go on, Messi. What's happening here? We'll skip it, lads, because we're going to crash the game. He's gone into the crowd. Maybe this guy's quit. That's the only explanation I have is this guy has quit. Messi. Absolute blistering goal. Come on, Messi. But, lads, we are going to end it there. Hopefully you enjoyed this episode. We get off to winning ways in Division 4. Hopefully you enjoyed it. And uh, we'll be back quite soon with another episode. We'll get back into winning ways, hopefully. We're done with the eFootball Open. We've got that, so hope you enjoy that one. But uh, yeah, let me know what you guys are thinking, lads. It's It just feels like the passing is like way more like haphazard now. That's, that's the way I would describe it. Um, but yeah, look, we do get off to winning ways, obviously. And hopefully we can continue that form, get up to Division 3. I will talk to you later. Um... Hope you're enjoying the series. Don't forget to like, favorite, and subscribe to the channel for a lot more content coming soon, including some Pez 2021 stuff, cheeky stuff. But uh, yeah, I'll talk to you in a bit, lads. Peace.